Well, hello everybody. I just want to share a quick seed thought with you from the Word of God, and it is a legit seed thought for you today. And uh, I'll start off with the scripture in James chapter 1, verse number 2 says, My brethren, account it all joy when you fall into diverse temptations, knowing this, that the trying of your faith worketh patience, or endurance. But let patience have her perfect work, that you may be perfect or mature, that you may be mature and entire, wanting nothing. So, I don't know how many of you out there are a patient person, but I, for one, am not a patient person by any means. And uh, we live in a society where we want things now, it's instant, it's on demand, high speed, 5G, it's there, we don't want to wait for anything. And uh, during the time of the quarantine, whenever it first started, um, I was at home and I was making a smoothie with my daughter Eden, and, uh, and I love to put avocados in my uh, smoothies. And so uh, I was getting ready to throw the seed away, and I said, Eden, how cool would that be if we could sprout that seed and grow a tree? And she was like, you can grow a tree from that? And I said, well, I think you can. So I, I looked it up, and you have to peel off this outer layer. you got to put uh, the toothpicks in it, and you got to stick it in a cup of water. And, and we did that. And, uh, and so about four weeks go by, and it's just sitting in a dirty uh, cup. The, the water looks dingy, and it's been about four weeks, and nothing had, had came out of the seed. And so uh, about four and a half weeks go by, and I said, well, evidently that avocado was not going to sprout, so I threw the seed away. Uh, I, I threw it in the trash, and I said, well, you know, it's just not going to grow. And so I was making another smoothie the next day, and, uh, and I said, I wonder if I could do it again. So I did the whole process again. I peeled it off. I stuck it in the water with the toothpicks and I started to do a little bit more research. And it says that a seed of an avocado tree can actually take up to six weeks for it to actually sprout. And uh, so I stuck the, um, the seed back in the water and uh, lo and behold, about five and a half weeks later, uh, here's my avocado seed and it's sitting in the water. And there is my baby avocado tree. Took six weeks for it to sprout, but the first time around, I thought that it should have been sprouting a, a little bit faster. I thought that it should be growing a lot faster than it was, so I threw it away. I scrapped it. I thought it wasn't going to work, and it just it hit me. How many times has God given us a promise or a word, or told us that our family was going to be saved, or whatever the situation is in your life, and, and he uh, gave you a spoken word, or or the or the uh, the written word, and just you didn't see it uh, uh, come to pass, and it just you thought that it was going to happen so sure in your heart, but it just never came to pass, and uh, and it just made me think about that we need to let our our patience or our our perseverance have its perfect work that it's in god's timing not my timing i cannot make this seed grow i cannot snap my fingers and make the seed grow but i can put it in the right soil or the right environment for it to grow and so but i'm not god i cannot make the seed uh, uh, grow itself but it is my duty and uh my obligation as a believer to put myself in the right environment, in the right seed, or I'm sorry, in the right soil or environment where it needs to grow. And so I just want to encourage somebody that if God has given you a promise or a word, you need to take him at his word. You cannot make it grow, but you can surround yourself and put yourself in the right a situation to allow that fruit or a, allow that seed to grow in your life in that situation. So I just want to encourage somebody to keep believing for your miracle, to keep believing for your family to be saved, to keep believing for that healing that he's spoken to your life. Because if he gave you the seed and you planted the seed, the seed knows what to do. 
We can't make the seed grow, but we need to put it in its right atmosphere and in, a, in an environment of faith and believing in God and knowing and trusting that he will bring it to pass because God is not a man that he should lie. God is the God of truth. And if he said it, you can take it to the bank. It's going to happen. Do not scrap or throw away your promise because it's not a, a, a growing in your own timing. We have to to believe God and allow him to grow us and establish us and be planted by the by the the rivers of water so I just want to encourage somebody this is a lesson from an avocado seed that God will grow you and sprout you in his time just put yourself in the in the uh, in the the right environment and around the right people and he will help you to grow thanks a lot and thanks for listening bye bye